Back here closer to home in Alameda, the family of a man who died in police custody last week are calling his death a murder after seeing video of what happened. But police say they did not use excessive force. J.R. Stone has the story. Go ahead and get it, Charlie. I got him. The rat? An Alameda police officer's knee holding down Mario Gonzalez, who died a matter of minutes after this was recorded. Police saying Gonzalez had a medical emergency. The officers had responded to a possible theft in the area and a call that came in about a disorderly and possibly intoxicated person. They spent more than 10 minutes unsuccessfully trying to figure out who Gonzalez was and what he was doing there. Somebody called and said you were uh, maybe not feeling so great. You come up with a plan. No, it's Let me know that you're not going to be drinking in our parks over here. Hey, yeah, like, like, get, you know, stuff like that. Yeah, and then yeah. we can be on our merry way, okay? Merry you way. have you have an ID on you? Merry go round. Investigators say no significant use of force was used. Body camera video makes it sound as though Gonzalez was struggling to breathe. It's okay. It's okay. What's your name? Gonzalez's family speaking out Tuesday after watching the video. They don't even try to talk to him. They know how the right to kill him. We humans, we, we're not cockroaches. Gonzalez's partner and mother of his son upset with this moment between officers. Think we can roll him on the side? I don't want to lose what I got, man. Okay. After that, he stopped screaming, he stopped making noise, and he stopped breathing. Family members believe it was the weight on Mario's back and head that killed him. CPR was performed a short time later, but unsuccessful. Alameda County's sheriff's and district attorney's office, along with the city's police department, all have open investigations and are awaiting toxicology and autopsy results. Alameda Police Department is not commenting on the matter.